स्टूडेंट्स जय हिंद वंदे मातरम वंस अगेन वेलकम बैक टू योर क्लास रवि सर जी मैथ्स द इजिएस्ट एंड फाइनेस्ट वे टू लर्न द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स स्टूडेंट्स इन आ प्रीवियस वीडियो लेक्चर ऑफ पेयर ऑफ लीनियर इक्वेशन विथ टू वेरिएबल वी हैव लर्न हाउ टू फाइंड आउट कंसिस्टेंसी ऑफ पेयर ऑफ लीनियर इक्वेशन विथ टू वेरिएबल स्टूडेंट्स इन आर फर्स्ट वीडियो लेक्शन वी हैव लर्न All types of method to find out pair of linear equation with two variable. Students, in our today video lessons, we are going to practice uh, graphical method to solve the pair of linear equation with two variables. Students, before starting today video lessons, if you are new to this channel, just subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon of your channel. okay students now here you can see that in our today video lessons we are considering four questions these four questions we will solve by graphical method okay students in our very first question you can see that the pair of linear equations are x is equal to 2y 3x plus 4y is equal to 20 so students whenever we are solving the pair of linear equation with two variables we have to keep it in mind few steps what you have to do in very first step uh, just formulate the given equations either in form of x or y right similarly you can consider in next step just consider different values of x to find out the different values of y okay in this there, there is no restrictions you are going to consider the different values of x as well as y you can consider 1 2 3 4 uh, or minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 all these things depends on the relations between x and y okay students let us see uh, how we can find out different solutions of these pairs of linear equation with two variable okay the first equation is what x is equal to 2y right students so consider this is equation 1 now you can consider the values of x either value of y here you have formulated x so you will consider the values of y so you can consider 1 2 3 4 either minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 these considerations depends on the relations between x and y okay students consider y is equal to 0 so we are getting x is equal to 2 into 0 so the value of x is what 0 similarly considering y is equal to 1 over here so what about x so x will be what 2 into 1 so we are getting 2 students now tabulating these values x and y what is the value of x uh, y over here 0 you are getting what x is 0 you have considered y is 1 the value of x is 2 okay students similarly we will solve the second equation 3x plus 4y is equal to 20 consider this is equation number 2 now you can formulate either x or y okay suppose you are formulating x so we are getting 3x is equal to 20 minus 4y okay so x is equal to 20 minus 4y by 3 now students here you will have to consider the different value of y in such a way that the value of x should be an integer integer means what 1 2 3 4 0 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 because students if you are getting the integral values so you can plot those points graph very easily so your target is to be what whenever you are considering the values of x or values of y the respective values of x or y should be in integer right because integer can be plot on the graph very easily okay students just we are going to select y over here in such a way that the value of x should be what integer okay so now considering 
the different values of y over here just you will have to uh, consider and you should uh, calculate all these things uh, in your mind okay consider y is equal to 2 right students so what we are getting 20 minus 4 into 2 by 3 okay so 20 minus 4 to the 8 by 3 so what we are getting 12 by 3 so the value of x will be what 4 right students we are uh, getting the first solution similarly you will have to consider different values of y in such a way that x should be integer just you will have to calculate in mind and then you can substitute over here okay so the next will may be what uh, suppose you are putting 3 over here then uh, otherwise suppose you are putting y is equal to minus 1 what minus 1 you can you will get what 24 otherwise 4 4 is 16 there will be 2 so 4 5 is 20 right students so we can write what y is equal to 5 over here right so what we are getting x is equal to 20 minus 4 into 5 by 30 okay so 20 minus 20 sorry not 30 3 3 so what we are getting 0 by 3 the value of x will be what 0 so again students we can tabulate these uh, solutions x and y in these solutions uh, very first solution is x is equal to 4 the y is 2 here is x is what 0 and y is 5 now students <coughs> your next target is to what plot this tabulated point of x and y on the graph what do you have to do you will have to plot this point on the graph okay so what do you have to do over here just draw an vertical and horizontal line we know that this is first second and third and fourth quadrant this is x axis this is y axis so you can write this one x dash and this is y dash and this uh, is known as origin so after origin this is o you can write over here 1 2 3 4 and 5 similarly there will be negative values over here here will be positive values students all these things you have considered these are positives these are positives and all these are positives so in first quadrant all the points are positive not need to mention the these points over here you can mention also so 1 2 3 4 minus 1 minus 2 and like that way similarly minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 okay students <clears throat> we will plot these lines on the graph x is equal to 2y x is equal to 2y the respective solutions are 0 and 0 so x is 0 and y is 0 so the points will be where at the origin this is 0 and 0 then 2 and 1 x is 2 and y is 1 so it might be like here x is 2 and y is 1 that is friends now you can draw the straight line okay about this one this is what this is a line of x is equal to 2y x is equal to 2y now we will draw the line of equation 3x plus 4y is 20 so all these solutions are 4 and 2 x is 4 x is 4 y is 2 right students it might be here x is 4 y is 2 then x is 0 y is 5 x is 0 and y is 5 so somewhere here <coughs> right students x is 0 and y is 5 
सो एक्स इज जीरो एंड वाई इज फाइव सो वी कैन डार्क दिस वन सो वी कैन ड्रो अ लाइन फ्रॉम हियर सो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज अ पॉइंट वेयर दीज टू लाइन्स विच आर थ्री एक्स प्लस फोर फोर वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी एंड एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू वाई इंटरसेक्टिंग एट दिस पॉइंट राइट स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज अ पॉइंट वेयर वी आर गेटिंग द यूनिक सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस पेयर ऑफ लिनियर इक्वेशन विथ टू वेरिएबल ओके सो एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू वाई सो वॉट मे बी द एग्जैक्ट वी आर नॉट गेटिंग दिस थिंग्स ओवर हियर इफ यू प्लॉट ऑल दिस थिंग्स ऑन द ग्राफ यू विल गेट द एग्जैक्ट वैल्यू ऑफ यूनिक सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस पेयर ऑफ लिनियर इक्वेशन विथ टू वेरी एबल राइट स्टूडेंट्स सो इफ यू आर यू विल सी दीज थिंग्स सो यू मे गेट वॉट लाइक दैट वे वाई इज टू एंड समवेयर एक्स इज फोर राइट सो approximately this and this so the solution point will be what uh, x is 4 and y is 2 okay students if you want to verify these things you can see that x is equal to 2y put the value of x over here x is 4 and value of y is 2 so 2 into 2 so we are getting 4 and 4 it means this is exact unique solution of this pair of linear equation the solution is 4 and 2 now students moving to the next question uh, next question is about same thing over here so 2x plus 3y is equal to 9 okay student so we can formulate either x or y suppose you are formulating x so 2x is equal to 9 minus 3y so what about x 9 minus 3y by 2 okay students now considering y is equal to 1 so what about x 9 minus 3 into 1 by 2 so 9 minus 3 by 2. What we are getting? 6. 9 minus 3, 6. 6 by 2. So x will be what? 3. Okay. We will find out the second solution uh, using this uh, formula. So what may be the second solution? Consider y is. Uh, Suppose you are considering two, not possible. Considering one, not possible. Considering y is minus one. What? Minus one. So what happen? X will be nine minus three into minus one by two. Okay, students. So nine minus three minus one. There will be plus three by two. You are getting twelve by two. So the value of x is six. Okay, students. Now we can tabulate these things: the value of x and the value of y. In first solution, value of x is three, and the value of y is one. In second solution, value of x is six, and the value of y is minus one. Similarly, students, we will solve this question. Uh, this equation. So first of all, writing 4x plus 6y is equal to 18. Now 2 will be common from here, so we are getting 2x plus 3y is equal to 18. This will be cancelled out. So 2x plus 3y is equal to 9. Now students, here you can see that equation one and two are same, right? Equation one and two are same. Equation one and Two are same. If these equations are same, it means what? A one by A two is equal to B one by B two is equal to C one by C two. Means there will be same solution of these two equations. So we don't need to solve these equations once again because 
दीज इक्वेशन टू एक्स प्लस थ्री वाई एंड फोर एक्स प्लस सिक्स वाई इज इक्वल टू एटीन बाई सिंप्लीफाइंग वी आर गेटिंग सेम इक्वेशन इट मीन्स वॉट इफ द बोथ द इक्वेशन आर सेम द सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस पेयर ऑफ लिनियर इक्वेशन विल बी इन्फाइनाइटली मेनी सोल्यूशन ओके सो प्लॉटिंग दिस पॉइंट ऑन द ग्राफ सो वन टू थ्री फोर माइनस वन माइनस टू माइनस थ्री माइनस फोर वन टू थ्री फोर माइनस वन माइनस टू माइनस थ्री माइनस फोर दिस इज एक्स एक्सिस वाई एक्स डैस एंड वाई डैस ओके स्टूडेंट्स थ्री एंड वन एक्स इज थ्री वाई इज वन एक्स इज थ्री वाई इज वन सो दिस पॉइंट विल बी ओवर यर एक्स इज सिक्स वाई इज माइनस वन एक्स इज सिक्स राइट स्टूडेंट्स सो लेट एक्सटेंड ओवर यर सो फाइव एंड सिक्स ओके so x is 6 and y is minus 1 it will be downward this is a line of which equation 2x plus 3y is equal to 9 right similarly after simplifying 4x plus 6y is equal to 18 again we are getting 2x plus 3y is equal to 9 so we can overlap these things once again they because these are the same solution right students so you can write what This is two x plus three y is equal to nine. What? And uh, what about this one? This blue re region is what? Four x plus six y is what? Eighty. Understood? So how many solution? Infinitely many solution. because coincident the equations are co incident okay students similarly moving to the question number 3 over here same process you will have to do just find out the solution of x and y of these two pair of linear equation and just plot on the graph okay now x minus 2y is equal to 6 formulating x so x is equal to 6 minus means will be plus 2y okay students suppose this is equation 1 now you can consider the values of y over here now you can consider the different values of y because uh, negative integer because in this way you can find out uh, smaller values so a smaller value is easier to sub, uh, plot on the graph okay so consider y is equal to 0 suppose y is equal to 0 you are getting x is equal to 6 into 2 into 0 so 6 plus 0 you are getting what 6 similarly consider y is equal to minus 1 so x will be what 6 plus 2 the value of y is minus 1 so 6 minus 2 is what 4 okay students so now we can tabulate these points x and y here you are getting x x is 6 the value of y is 0 x is 4 the value of y is minus 1 similarly 3x minus 6y is equal to 0 so 3x will be what is equal to 6y this can be cancelled out so x is equal to 2y right students now you can substitute the values of y suppose y you are considering 0 so x will be 2 into 0 so x is what 0 now considering y is what 1 so x will be 2 into 1 so 2 again you can tabulate these points x and y the value of x is in very first solution value of x is 0 and the value of y is 0 here you are getting value of x is 2 and the value of y is 1 okay students now we can plot these points on the graph one two three four minus one minus two minus three one two three four 
माइनस वन माइनस टू माइनस थ्री माइनस फोर दिस इज वॉट एक्स एक्सिस यूर यू कैन राइट एक्स डैस वाई एंड वाई डैस ओके स्टूडेंट्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल प्लॉटिंग द फर्स्ट लाइन एक्स इज सिक्स वाई इज जीरो एक्स इज सिक्स एंड वाई इज जीरो सो वी कैन एक्सटेंड ओवर हियर फाइव एंड दिस इज सिक्स ओके एक्स इज सिक्स वाई इज जीरो सो दिस पॉइंट विल बी ओवर हियर Now x is four, y is minus one. X is four, y is minus one. It will be comes to downward. It means fourth quadrant. Here x is, so we can plot this line in this way. So this is what x minus two y is equal to six. Similarly, plotting this line on the graph. So the points are x is. Zero and y is zero, so that will be on the origin. Now x is two, y is one. X is two, y is one. Okay. X is two, y is one. Okay, students. Now plotting these points, drawing these points. So students, you can see that. these pair of linear equations are parallel so this is what 3x minus 6y is equal to 0 so no solution no solution because these lines are parallel okay students now to final question of today video lesson You will have to do it by yourself because this equation, question number four, is similar to question number three. Just I'm going going to make some basic ideas how you can plot all these things on the graph. Okay, <clears throat> so students, here you can see that two x plus three y is equal to ten, and here is four x plus six y is equal to twelve. Okay, students, so two will be common from here, so you are getting two x plus three y is equal to twelve. These will be cancelled out. So two x plus 3y is it what 6. So students, you can see that here on the LHS side, here on the LHS side, both are equal. It means we know that a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 does not is equal to c1 by c2. It means the lines will be parallel. The line will be parallel. Lines are parallel. Okay, students. So there will be no solution. But what do you have to do over here? You have to just find out the solution similar to question number three, and you will plot the graph, and you will you can see that these lines are parallel to in this way, means parallel to the to each other. So, students, I hope you have understood today video lessons. For more video lessons of this chapter, keep watching your channel Ravi Sarji Maths. Thank you, thank you so much.